here we are this is my day two at road trip we'll see how i go today i've got a bit of uh bit of work to do to redeem myself sally first day of racing three tenths of a second off my best so uh we'll have to see how we can go today and what we can get down the track at but uh yeah it's been a good meet there's heaps of cars here uh if you haven't checked out the uh the video of the whole lot then uh you know it's probably here somewhere or coming up in the next week we'll find out but uh there should be a few videos of each day here with everybody as well as uh each of our days and how we went out here in our own experience at road trip so yeah keep watching make sure you like subscribe so dad you're uh day two we're out here uh yesterday we we came out and did some racing and um you haven't got much of a gap between you and mum so you're out here this morning sussing out the track i've got to check out the track we've got to have a look at the prep see what's going on out here is very important three tenths of a second uh between us we can't let this happen it, this is just not going to happen right surely not surely look, she I'm... can't come out here on the first ever time and and beat us i'm look i'm well off my um uh pb so far i've got to got to beat a 771 what am i at a 793 so yeah we should be able to beat that today hopefully the track will hold up and uh, we'll see how the car goes yeah well, uh, yesterday it's a bit it's a bit rough for me. What about you, mate? What well, you? well, I'm a, I'm about a second behind. Yeah. We had our first race. Yep. Uh, I was struggling with the heat and a bit of driver error, just trying to get boost off of the line. So, if I can make it a little less lazy off the line and get get my 60 foot into the ones, into the like a one nine or one eight or something like that, I think I'll I think I'll go pretty quick. Well, you got to watch Big Red's uh, getting the mile per hour up as well now. So, it is, uh, yes. So we've got, I think, 92 mile an hour on our best. Oh, there you go. I think yesterday. mine's 91. So. Yeah, yeah. So uh, previously, I don't think we'd even got into the 90 mile an hour range. So. Well, there you go. So you get more mile an hour. Mm. Well, we'll see what happens. You never know. The, uh, the underdog could come through and take it when he's got a power glide. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. Anyway, you don't have one for day two. No, I don't. Maybe day one of next year. We have uh, one hour to start racing. Well, let's crack straight into it. Whilst Dave and Sal were out on the track putting down their first run, Tyler and Brad were out on the road doing the road trip part of day two.
day two. Yep. Cruiser out two. Yes. You excited? I am. The uh, the car's been going really well. Uh, I'm just going to work out how to get it off the line. So I'm either going going too far one way or too far the other. So I either blow the wheels off a bit or I go really slow. So I just got to find that happy medium now where it, where it just takes off. Well, hopefully we can sort that out today and get a decent get at least one decent time slip in for you. Yep. So we'll see how, we'll see how the cruiser out goes. Uh, do you know where we're heading, Tyler? We are heading to Schultz Meet Tavern today in Plainlands. So it should be a pretty good cruise. Yep. And uh, enjoy, guys. should be able to get faster again hopefully but for the first run of the day it's in 9.0 it's not too bad um, it's only 87 mile an hour so the mile an hour is down a little bit as well so we will see what happens we'll definitely run run another pass so, today and uh, yeah we'll let, let's see what happens we'll, we'll get the 60 foot in, in a second and we'll check that out so it didn't feel as slow off the start, but I think it can, I think I can definitely launch it a little bit harder. So it's still pretty slow in the 60 with a 2.3, so we're definitely still way off where we were in previous uh, at the road trip test and tune last year at Warwick. So there's definitely more in it. Um, I think I just gotta baby it a little less and, and just go for it. So. We'll pull it back around and go for another pass before we pull it up for a little bit and let it fill down again.
PB, mate. Are you uh, happy with the uh, day's runs? Yes, yeah. So PB'd first at an 8.5, went back around and then PB'd again at an 8.3. So day so, two is a tick for you? Yes, yeah, pretty stoked with that. It uh, doesn't help my dial in because I dialed in at 8.85, uh, so I'm a bit too quick for that dial in now. Why is your dial in so off? You got to do three passes before you had to put a dial in. It was yeah. uh, I ran so two 12 second passes and one eight nine pass. So. <laughs> well, you're a bit lost. Yes, yes. Yeah, so I was like, all right, I'll dial in at like an 885 or something and see what happens. All right, well, let's get back out the track, mate, and just have a bit of fun, eh? Yeah, we'll get out for the dial your own tonight and see what we can do. Done. Okay, How do we go? We got a wind line. The uh, bloke next to me said, came up to me. We had a chat afterwards. He blew the tyres off of it off the line. He said before it. He's prob that's probably what's going to happen. So, pretty stoked. Yes. Yeah. We'll go again. We'll see see if we can get any closer to the dial. And we were pretty far off of it. Nine two on an eight five. So, what's going on, mate? Oh, mate, I got to buy back in. Oh no! What mate, happened, mate? I uh, red lit. Red lit. First round. Red light. Ooh. The nerves got to you, mate. Mate, they, they did. I, I jumped a bit early uh, up against Greg Barrett there and uh, in the silver um, statesman. So, uh, yeah, look, even if I didn't, he still would have got me anyway. So, I ran a good time 777 uh, on a 775 dial so not in. Too bad, pretty close. Uh, except for my red light. Yeah. Uh, and he ran a 7401 on a 740 dial in. <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. So we'll see. You. 20 bucks, buy back in, and uh, we'll, we'll see how we go for this next round. Good luck, mate. Thanks, mate. Had to yep. buy back in. No, no, I just put in the peg. I'm finished. Oh, you, you, you're not going to have another crack? You're nah. too far off the money? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. I'm not running close to my dial in. And uh, I don't want to push the car too hard, so i still got one day left. Okay. What happened there, mate? What happened on that one? Oh, just sleeping at the light, really. In comparison <laughs> to me, my opponent, he cut a 008 light and I point two four. so... Well, there you go, mate. You can uh, go to the beer tent. Yeah. Dave, what happened? Round two, what happened to you? Mate, that's twice all red lit, so uh, yeah, I just got the mocker. I, I couldn't handle the pressure. <laughs> well, I haven't, uh, I haven't done a red light all weekend, and uh, I get into the, the dial your own comp and do it twice. Two rounds, straight out, bang, gone. All right, Sal, how did you go? Day two. Uh, not as good as day one. <laughs> not as good as day one, no, so. No, I couldn't get under an eight. Okay. I did run at 8.05. Uh, but yeah, couldn't get any better than an eight. Okay, so just not quite getting it together like day one. No, looked like last, you had it all. My last run that I actually got six, everything ran six together. Six forty-three, ninety-seven miles per hour. Speed flow lane. It's just a matter of just getting your rhythm, getting it picked. Yeah. Are you having fun? Oh, and uh, again, we got yeah. the uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's awesome. Chrysler Sigma. Do we need more power? In the rocket industry uh, lane. Oh, maybe, <laughs> maybe, I, I haven't decided. That in the comments you below, you need LA. to go faster. One from the, uh, <laughs> I guess we need more power. <laughs> I don't know what sort of power I want though, whether I want turbo or what, but yeah. Wow, well, there's more, more, more for the comments section. <laughs> no, uh, alright, we've, uh, we've got to yeah, wrap up the day. 
get into it, have a crack for day three, yep. and uh, wrap up the weekend. The end of day two. Day two, mate, done and done. Yes. Yeah. Not one and done, we're done and done, because it was definitely not one run. How many did you do? Uh, nine runs, and then two in the DYO, because I made it through yep. to the second round. I did win my first round. Uh, I, I decided I wasn't going to buy back in just because I had some other stuff to organise for the rest of the evening. Yep. So, uh, but yeah, I got out in the second round. I was caught sleeping at the light by my opponent. He cut a double O eight while I did a point two four. So, yeah, we uh, we were pretty busy last night. We did the the racing all day. Then we uh, had a crack at the dial your own, as you said. Yeah. Um, I, I I went no good. I did buy back in, mm -hmm. and um, I yeah went on the red light twice. <laughs> I, I, I got I got a bit keen. Didn't happen for me. So, uh, uh, but that was that was a great event. Four thousand dollars last night uh, given to the winner. Uh, yeah. So Sean uh, took that out in the in the Willie's uh, um, hot rod. Yeah, and there was eleven hundred dollars in the buyback plus five hundred dollars extra put up by Aussie Florinators as well for second place. For second isn't place, it? place. Yeah. So sixteen hundred bucks for second place. Third got five hundred. Third got five hundred. They did. So, so it's well worth getting out and giving it a go because you never know like if you if you run a consistent time doesn't matter how fast you are yeah 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 it's all handicapped so yeah any car can can win that but uh uh that's part of the entry for a road trip as mm -hmm. well so uh it was good we, we enjoy that it's a bit of fun mm -hmm. uh even though we didn't get very far we had no. a bit of fun yes um we got a bit, a bit further last year than mm -hmm. that one and yes. yeah this year i come back with more experience and did worse <laughs> i don't know i don't know how that happened well maybe you haven't been cutting lights all weekend i don't know I, no, I, I, that was the only two red lights I've had all weekend was in that. Uh, but we had a, had a ball. Uh, we didn't have any of the footage for the rest of the night. Uh, well, we did have the footage of that on the, on the live stream. Check that out. There's commentary and all that. We'll throw a few bits and pieces of that. Um, but the rest of our night, we uh, we had the the party, the presentations, yeah. um, the we dress up, dress up. We had the back 80s theme. The 80s. I still got my my back to the 80s overtaking lane. We were we we were dressed up as overtaking lane in the 80s. Yeah, retro shirt coming to an overtaking lane shop near you. Yeah, was it? Uh, I don't know if you can see that coming coming to you soon on video cassette. Um, <laughs> maybe we'll throw a retro shirt up on the shop. Yeah, um, get that out there. We got to we got to do some updated merch. Merch drop coming. Mm -hmm. Uh, other than that, mate, we've got to get into day three now. Yes. They're, they're already out here racing. Yep. Uh, yeah. People are already watching the live stream out there. Mm -hmm. And uh, we've got to run our cars now, yep. get our la last day of pass, yep. and uh, get through and get a couple of time slips. Yes. How are you travelling? Well, yesterday, as you as you would have saw earlier in the video, I hit a PB, 8.3. Yep. Th so. How'd that go for your dial in? Uh, not well, so I didn't run anywhere near it again. But, uh, <laughs> but my dial in for the actual dial your own class, I'm way faster than that now and I can't get anywhere near it. So There you go, so you just got to keep trying, but uh, but yeah, mate, uh, you'll, you'll know better for next year. What, do you, what else you got to change for next year? Oh, uh, you know, maybe an auto. <laughs> I have a chance in a race against you. Anyway, yeah, that'll be next road trip. Yeah. Tyler loses an auto. <laughs> we mine, feel like we've, we've done this before. <laughs> All right, we're going to do some footage and uh, show you a bit more about it instead of just looking at our ugly heads. Yeah, we'll, we'll see you in the next one, guys. Stay in that rocket lane.